somebody make some noise. Thanks for being with us. With me today, we've got three-time Grammy winner who's carrying the torch of traditional American music, better known as blues, the one and only Keb Mo. Well, thank you very much, Mr. Yes, sir. It's good to have you here. The roots of, 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 uh, of gospel music, uh, some people say that the roots of gospel comes from the blues. I'm one who says the roots of blues comes from the gospel until I think about it. Because before we had spirituals, you know, the, the, the blacks had spirituals. But I think the blues, I have to, re I have to rethink myself. Yeah. I think the blues gave us the rhythm, gave us the beat that caused Mahalia Jackson to become as great mm -hmm. as she was mm -hmm. and as ostracized as she was. Because they mm -hmm. wouldn't let Mahalia come into the churches because they said she was a blues singer. Uh -huh. Because of the instrumentation, the way she would swing her hips, the way she would sing. <laughs> like, Rosette, like, like our Sister Rosetta Tharpe. Like Rosetta Tharpe with her guitar. Oh, I mean, Sister Rosetta Tharpe was throwing it down. So, so the <laughs> blues really impacted the African-American music form that we know across the board. Well, it all came from the same place. I think it all came from field hollers. Mm -hmm. You know, the old field hollers where the people, if they would shout across in code, there was codes yeah. that the way the slaves would communicate things and things like, oh, the blood, oh, the blood, sign my name, mm -hmm. oh. You know, just things like just. Wade in the water and yeah. stuff like that, yeah. Yeah, like the, 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 the uh, you know, the Underground Railroad, there was code, these songs would became codes. Yeah. that uh, the white folks couldn't understand what they were talking about. Kev, thanks for taking this time, man. I, I appreciate it. Mr. Donnie McClurkin. Thank you. <laughs>